leave me alone? Detective, I've been looking for you. All over Paris, men have been going suddenly blind and become paralyzed. My son is the latest victim. I've heard you might be able to help. I'll explain the details when you arrive. This is my address. Good evening, Detective. My name is Marie. Thank you for coming. I'm worried about my son Julian. You see, recently he's become obsessed with a beautiful woman. Since he met her, Julian has been disappearing for days at a time. Then he stole my jewelry and threatened to elope with her. He even built her a boat for that purpose. He spent most of this time at the traveling circus, until the night I found him lying in the street, paralyzed and blind. I don't want anyone else to suffer like Julian. Oh, please, take this. I pray it helps you find the culprit. Recently, a traveling circus came to town. The main attraction was a fiery chimera. It piqued my interest, so I attended. But I was truly blown away by this dancer in the mask. I didn't really care for the elephants or the rest of the show, but I just had to see that masked girl again. Every night she performed, I put on my best necktie and attended. It was refreshing to escape from mother. As the days of my calendar changed, I realized I couldn't stand living with my mother anymore. Conversely, the love for my dancer only grew stronger. I've packed my stuff, including some of mother's jewelry, and prepared a boat to elope with the love of all my life.
Spider Linda, another man has suffered because of you. You mustn't remove your mask. I know. I'm sorry, Jean-Pierre. Please don't leave me. I need your support. Of course. I'll protect you no matter what. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Hello, Detective. I'm Bernard, the director of this circus. I've heard some strange rumors about what's been happening in this city. Our circus is always on the go, so we shall be leaving soon, I think. Our circus has many talented performers, like our acrobat, Theodore, and our strongman, Jean-Pierre. But I bet you're looking for our main attraction, the Dancing Chimera. Her real name is Adelinda. I could arrange a meeting for you, but I want to test your skills. If you find my missing card and beat my game, you shall see Adelinda. This is the only help I will give you.
certainly earned the opportunity to meet our star. Use this to enter the circus trailer. If you excuse me, I must attend to our animals. I'm growing tired of my circus life. Now, only the audience's cheers bring me joy. They love my performances. This circus life is all I've ever known. They're my family. But the only one who cared about me is Jean-Pierre. He supported me ever since we were little.
I used to only dream of finding happiness, but now I've fallen in love with a young officer named Philippe. Tonight, I'm going to confess my love to him.
What have you done?
Good evening, Detective. My name is Claude. You are looking for Adelinda, yes? A friend of mine was one of her victims, so we have the same goal. This is the second town I have followed Adelinda to, but I simply cannot catch her. I recently saw her run into the abandoned cathedral. Perhaps if we work together, we'll be able to make her pay for her crimes. Jean-Pierre and I were normal once. He was a handsome boy, and wore no mask. We spent all our time together, dreaming of performing in the circus. But one day, we did something we could not undo. We opened a terrible book. Oh, how I wish we had never touched it. On that day, the world as we knew it came to an end.
Wonderful. We're on the right track now, Detective. We simply must catch her. Here. This may be useful later. Nothing wrong! I've been attending to the traveling circus, trying to win an audience with Adelinda. No. But she refused to see me or accept my gifts. So one day, when she was alone, I followed her into an alley, but another man, Philippe, got in my way. It was the first and last time he would ever do so.
I swear I never wanted to hurt anyone. <gasps> Look out! Thank you for bringing out Alinda to me, Detective. Thank you. I apologize for the way I spoke to you earlier. Or didn't speak. We thought you were like Claude. Oof. He managed to knock me out this time. He's been after Adelinda for a long time. I protect her. Have you seen her bracelet anywhere? It means a lot to me. Adelinda and I have been working together at the circus since we were children. We took care of animals. She was a dancer who wore beautiful jewelry, and I made a show of my exceptional strength. One day, we found a mysterious book. It was a book of spells. We enjoyed the pictures of the Chimera. There were symbols and numbers in the book too, and... We read them. I could feel my heart skip a beat as I turned into an ugly hunchbacked boy. But Adelinda turned into a stunning beauty. But her beauty comes at a cost. She blinds and paralyzes all men who see her face. She must wear a mask and carry a fan to hide herself. 
My own curse is protection against hers, so I protect her. The only things that can save us, the book and the curse stone, are missing. housed in the museum, detective. It is the only thing that can free us. But the museum is closed. You'll need to disguise yourself as a guard to get in. I'll be on the lookout for Claude and Adelinda. We must find them before he does something terrible.
Good afternoon. I'm afraid you cannot access the storage area without a special pass. I'll be happy to help you find the book you need, but uh, I must ask a favor in return. That pesky mouse stole my pipe again. If you can find it and fill it, I'll get you your book. There has been a war between the forces of dark and light. The dark wants to control the world using magical powers. The light wants to preserve peace and balance on Earth. Well, one of the dark forces is the Cobra Society. They are known throughout Europe and have incredible powers. Their headquarters are in Paris, but they are adept at hiding. The Chimera's light forces continue to make sure they do not cause trouble. Ah, thank you. Ah, I'm a man of my word. Uh, this will help you find your book. I it came to our museum not long ago, but you must be careful with it.
You found it! Now we have to find Adelinda. There's not much time. Claude ran off toward the post office. Take this. It'll help you get there. I need to stay and treat my wounds, but I'll catch up with you soon.
Claude could return at any moment. Thank you, Detective. I'm glad to meet his friends at last. I am Adelinda. I must hide my face because of the curse. Only Jean-Pierre is safe to look upon me without my chimera mask. He helps me. Claude is a liar. He has followed me through two towns already. He'll do anything to capture me. We must work together. But I'll need my fire fans. The chimera spirit will help us stop Claude. Then... We can take the cursed stone from him. Here. You won't stop me! Hurry! Adelinda! Thank you, Detective. Claude won't threaten us anymore. Now, we must only lift the curse.
Thank you for returning our lives. <laughs> Finally!